Hello, second grade writers, it's Miss Butler. And today we are going to be working on some planning in our writing. Our writing about families, right? That's what we've been working on. Let's start by remembering how awesome families are and listening to this fun song about that same topic. What makes your family special and unique? Hey, how are you doing? How's your family keeping? Well, your family is probably quite different from my family. And my family is very different from other people's families. Our families are all different. Some of us have got brothers and sisters. Some of us live with our parents. Some of us are adopted. Some of us are fostered. Some of us live with our grandparents, some with us, some of us live with other relatives or other people we know. Some of us live loads of us all in one house. And sometimes we just have one grown up who looks after us. All families are different and that's exactly how it should be. And this is a song about families and how great they are. Maybe you could learn this song and then sing it to someone in your family. Here we go. hope you like that song as much as I did. We are all special and different. All families are unique. And you all have your own opinions. That's unique too. We can talk about our opinions. That is, we can say them out loud, but we can also write about our opinions. And when we do that, 
we can persuade others. Persuade means changing somebody's, someone else's opinion by explaining or reasoning. And that's why we always have to give reasons to support our opinion because that's how we are persuasive. We convince other people to think what we're thinking. So let's take a look at how we can be persuasive in talking about what makes our own families special or different. That's our focus for today. We're gonna to begin by thinking of some reasons. What are some reasons that your family is special? So stop and think. If you're on Zoom, you can raise your hand with your teacher and share some reasons. If you're sitting at your house watching this, then just think in your mind, hmm, what makes your family special? Well, now that we have our ideas about what makes our family special in our minds, we're going to plan our writing around those ideas. Good writers plan their writing. So you're going to plan your writing by getting a piece of paper and a pen. Then you're going to take your paper and you're going to draw a line going up and down, that's called vertical, and a line across, that's called horizontal. And look, that makes one, two, three, four sections for you to write and plan in. Each section can include one reason that your family is special. Here are some of the reasons I thought of about my family. So one reason I thought my family has a lot of people in it. That's special. Everyone in my family loves dogs. Everybody, everyone in my whole family has a dog. Let's see, other reasons. My family likes to cook meals together. Everybody cooks together. We make a big, big meal for everyone. And last reason, maybe the most important one. Most importantly, my family loves each other. So I use this planning sheet that I just made myself with a, by making up and down line, a vertical line, and a horizontal line. And then in each section of my paper, I wrote a reason. I'm going to take this planning sheet and I'm gonna put it somewhere really safe and careful because tomorrow I'm gonna use my planning sheet to help me write my opinion about why my family is special. So when you are finished writing your reasons in your planning sheet, make sure you put your sheet somewhere special too because we're gonna be coming back to it Tomorrow. tomorrow, we'll use these planning sheets to write opinions. So get to work. I can't wait to hear what you're all thinking, all the reasons behind what makes your family so special.